Here are 10 secret phone call tools on internet that can gather info from phone numbers, change caller ID, and even access phone networks. These are real, open source tools available right now. For each tool, I'll show you how to defend your calls and data. Phone Infoga is a tool that scans public sources, APIs, and online directories to gather detailed information about any phone number you enter. It can reveal the carrier, country, line type, and check for linked social media accounts, shopping profiles, or data breaches. Phone Infoga automates the process, showing just how exposed your number is online. To protect yourself, practice good digital hygiene and be proactive about your privacy. Use a secondary number for non-essential signups, newsletters, or online contests. Regularly remove your number from online profiles where it's not necessary. Separate your personal, work, and online numbers to limit exposure. Use privacy tools to erase your digital traces and delete unnecessary information. These steps make it much harder for attackers to find and exploit your number. Attackers can fake any number on your caller ID, making it look like someone you know is calling, even when it's a scammer. That's why you might see calls from your bank, doctor, or family, but it could actually be a scam. Scammers use this trick to get you to share sensitive info, like passwords or bank details. Never trust caller ID as proof of who's calling. If a call seems suspicious, don't answer or hang up right away. If you get a call from your bank or another important place, hang up and call back using the official number from their website or your card. Use call blocking and spam detection features on your phone to filter out known scam numbers. Trust your instincts. If something feels off, don't engage. Never share sensitive information over an incoming call. Legitimate organizations won't pressure you for private details. Always verify before you trust. Double-check the caller's identity before taking any action. Meet Asterisk, the open-source PBX that powers business phone systems. It handles call routing, voicemail, conference calls, and more, all customizable. Its flexibility makes it popular, but also a big target. If attackers get admin access, they control the whole phone system, eavesdropping, redirecting calls, or making expensive international calls. The main risk, poorly secured servers, default passwords or exposed admin interfaces. Defend by using strong VAP, unique passwords and restricting admin access behind a VPN or trusted IPs. Keep asterisk and your OS updated. Segment your network, put voice traffic on a separate VLAN. Harden your PBX like any critical infrastructure. One weak link can compromise your entire phone system. Sipvicious is the tool that scans for vulnerable VoIP systems. SIP is the protocol most VoIP phones use to talk to PBX systems. SIP Vicious scans IP ranges, finds active SIP devices, and maps out extensions. Then it tries to brute force passwords for those extensions. Weak passwords make it easy for attackers to take over accounts, listen to voicemails, or make calls as someone else. The fix? Strong, unique passwords for every extension. Enforce password complexity and use tools like Fail2Ban to block brute force attempts. Never expose SIP ports to the open internet unless absolutely necessary. Restrict access to trusted locations only. Multi-layered defense is key. Don't let your phone system be an easy target. Lock down your SIP interfaces and monitor for attacks. Not all threats come from hacker tools. Mainstream platforms like Twilio can be abused too. Twilio lets developers automate calls and texts for legitimate business needs but attackers can use it to launch massive robocall or phishing campaigns with just a few lines of code. They can buy blocks of numbers, automate calls, and personalize messages using breached data. The platform isn't malicious, but it can be weaponized. Attackers often use stolen credit cards, spin up accounts, and disappear before being shut down. If you use Twilio, secure your API keys, never share or commit them publicly. Set up usage alerts for unusual activity. For everyone else, be wary of unsolicited automated calls. These platforms make large-scale scams cheap and easy. Stay alert and protect your communication channels. Evil Limiter lets attackers control and disrupt devices on a local network by scanning, identifying, and throttling or blocking bandwidth. On public Wi-Fi, it can ruin call quality or disconnect you from the internet. Protect yourself by avoiding sensitive calls on public Wi-Fi and using a trusted VPN to encrypt your traffic. On home or work networks, enable port isolation and ARP spoofing detection on your router.
Keep devices updated, use strong passwords, and install firewalls to secure your network. Stay vigilant on shared networks to keep your data and calls safe. Open source PBX tools like OpenPBX and scripting libraries like Kali make automation and eavesdropping easy. If an attacker compromises your PBX, they can silently record calls or fork audio to hidden extensions. Automated scripts can capture every conversation, collecting sensitive info without anyone noticing. There's no warning, everything looks normal while your calls are being recorded. The danger is in the silence. Attackers can gather weeks of audio undetected. Defend by encrypting and restricting PBX management interfaces. Regularly audit call routing and recording settings. Monitor logs for unexplained changes. Apply least privilege. Only trusted admins should have access to powerful features. Watch for red flags and act fast. Don't let your PBX become a corporate bugging device. Vigilance and access control are your best defenses. Even with a secure PBX, network misconfigurations can expose you. VLANs are meant to isolate voice traffic, but attackers can exploit misconfigured switches to hop into the voice VLAN. By mimicking a VoIP phone or using double-tagged packets, they can access unencrypted voice data. Once inside, attackers can capture raw call traffic, bypassing all your other defenses. This shows that phone security is a chain. One weak link breaks the whole system. Layer your defenses. Secure devices, PBX, APIs, and the network itself. Regularly audit VLAN configurations and switch settings. Don't let a simple misconfiguration undo all your hard work. Every layer matters in phone security. Stay proactive and close every gap. Let's wrap up with a quick defensive checklist. Use strong, unique passwords for PBX and every extension. Segment your network. Keep voice traffic isolated and VLANs properly configured. Apply least privilege. Restrict admin access and monitor privileged accounts. Set up alerts for unusual activity. Call spikes, failed logins, or config changes. Practice digital hygiene. Limit where you share your number and never trust caller ID. Always verify sensitive requests by calling back official numbers. These five pillars will block most attacks we've covered. Use these tools to test your own defenses and fix weak spots before attackers find them. Stay safe, stay informed,